had the the other dots already seen. Well, not the choruses, the you know the the roads in the in the in the bridge. Mm -hmm. We got it uh, signed when we did the first record, so we didn't have to re-record them. Oh, okay. but I did all the other notes. I did the the main song, the main voice, and all the other notes. Mm -hmm. So it was it was really a, a, a pain in the ass. Times a pain <laughs> in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> so you already knew you were going to do this when you initially recorded yeah. the the Imperial yeah. version. We got, the, this, we got the, the plan. We have this problem, man, and we we want to try what 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 can happen. If we can reach uh, Europe, you know, uh, no, America, nice. yeah, we, we want to try it. And mm -hmm. we have to work, and we're we're planning a lot of stuff, and but we have to do in this. You way. know, what happens to us in Mexico is that we get the we are we are already at the at the, at the top. top, not not like the most. Uh, I don't want to be like bragging. We are not the the most uh, rich important. land or the important or, or those things, but we did everything in Mexico. If you mm -hmm. see, if you, I don't know if you got our press kit, but mm -hmm. you can see all the things that the band has made. And so we want to. We need to try another another market. We want to see another people, another horizon, other things. Yeah, another. Like I said, we want to get to another years, another minds. And if it's in Europe that we are really pumped to go, it's in Europe, and they want to play at uh, I don't know back in at uh, ever download at uh, this the uh, hell fest every 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 fest and and every bar if it's in in a bar we we want to be there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we we know that we're gonna start from zero, and that's yeah. that's uh, that's uh, 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 that's the reality. No. Yeah, but if we can reach some some festival in between, it's gonna be cool. But we 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 want to do this, man. I mean, we love to play in our country. We love to play in in front of our our audience, yeah. in the Latin American audience. But it's 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 something that we have to conquer. We have I don't know conquer. We we have to play. Okay, yeah, we uh, have to do. We have to put the you know the mark that we did it. Yeah, I'm our to do list, living to do list. Have you already uh, uh, practiced playing this material live with the English lyrics? Because I can understand that's going to be kind of a mental switch you have to go through uh, <laughs> if, if you're used yeah, to singing them in Spanish for three it's years. Kind of hard. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of hard because you're waiting the the part that you already know and and maybe you don't know that well. So. <laughs> no, it's gonna be cool. I think, like I was saying uh, at the beginning, I I played a lot of we played a lot of metal English metal uh, songs and and it's it's like just a switch. We even did I don't know which year it was, but we did a, a, a symphonic Metallica show. Mm. We did all the symphonic, uh, yes, SM. Oh, yeah, yeah, of that huge. album and and that we did that one and so it was really natural obviously when it's come, it comes from your to your songs it's gonna be a little you gotta think a little bit more the the words that's coming but it's a muscle you get it mm -hmm. You know, always a band is going to be a family, but we have an issue at 2005, I think. Six. six. It was six. six. Yeah. And it, that was a, a very hard one, man. It's an, an accident, a car accident. You know, we are going to, to the tour. And believe me, we, we are very near to lose our lives, man. So uh, Everybody gets hurt. Everybody has a lot of issues with 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 his health. So everybody we, has, has surgery. Yeah. Mm. So uh, 
it's I think the 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 time to uh, recover it's about a, a year a year and a half and you you suddenly stop to talk about music and the band that you know we're gonna go this 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 way and we're, we we can do this no suddenly you have to ask to your friend how are you are you okay can I help you and all the family uh, involves in the in this situation so I think that 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 issue uh, changed a lot of the dynamics in the band and sometimes I get angry with Eduardo and Eduardo gets angry with the other one but I, I I don't know, man. You, 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 uh, you are above that situation now, man. Because you, you, you saw your friend lying in the in the highway, don't uh, without knowing what to do, man, and mm -hmm. and without a cell phone that can help us. So, so it's a it's a tough one, but I think that made the band very tough, very united, and that I, I can assure this. But I can't. I can't guarantee this. But uh, I. I have. I think we have a, a very very high uh, uh, tolerance between us because we know that there's something more important that the band. Yeah. It, uh, it's 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 my it's my brother, man. Okay, and the other guys the same thing. So uh, it's a family, a very a very good family. In mm -hmm. fact, if if we don't. If we are not on tour or something, I don't know. When it's my birthday, the first person that I think about it's it's them. I'm not uh, uh, tired to see them. Okay, I enjoy their their company. We got hit to a bus, and we got all the equipment, we got all the amplis and everything inside the van, and so it hit us. We were like in at five a.m. Because we were doing the the trip at night, and that was uh, the the bad thing doing doing it at, at night. But the promoter was with us, and they told us that he was he he was doing this trip all his life. And as a matter of fact, this time the the trip took his life. He was the the one who who died. Mm -hmm. e everyone else uh, we were hurt, but but everyone lived. And he was the only one who died in the in the car accident. So it was really, really a, a serious thing mm -hmm. that uh, make us stop for a year and a half. In, in that time, we did the, the the acoustic record album, the Silencio album. Sorry, the the Silencio Acústico is called. Mm -hmm. It's it's almost it's in the, in the in the streamings too, and uh, but it was really hard, a, a very hard time for the band, and, and we we came out stronger. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Renacer, uh, it's a special one because when the the meaning of Renacer is uh, reborn. Reborn. So. Oh yeah, that makes uh, sense. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and when when we have that accident, uh, that song. Uh, took a lot of uh, uh, a lot a lot of a lot to do with our fans because when we have that accident, a lot of fans do a, a collect. We need a special ambulance because we're out of Mexico City, so they fly us. And uh, uh, how they can you name that? Oh, aerial ambulance. Mm -hmm. so they yeah. they they do they sold a lot of things and do collects and something. And when yeah. we have this, we were uh, yeah, when we have this uh, comeback, the last song was Renacer, and every now everybody knows that that song now means the comeback of the band. So mm -hmm. I love, we got, I we, love that song, man. Yeah, and and that album came out in two thousand and five, and the the accident was in two thousand and six. So the the they took that song like a like a hymn, like a flag. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we gotta work again with the band, and everyone, everyone has has his job outside of the band. So we 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 can say that we eat from a job, and we live for this job that it's for. It's the band. 
that uh, uh, that that way we can keep on doing our lives normally in a, in a year and a half. But uh, the band was never out of out of uh, our minds, and the proof is that we we did a, an album, an acoustic album, and and it was really cool because we can like uh, see another things, uh, explore another type of music that we are, we love to, and we can put it on that album. So. Mm -hmm. It, I, I guess you've always been. I, I, you're not the type of band that records the same album twice in a row. Um, Thank it, you. Has it been important for you? How important has it been to explore something new each time? The most important. In mm -hmm. fact, that's that's the that's the issue that uh, cause all the the fights, man. Because you know <laughs> we are we are repeating ourselves and come on, yeah. let's try this cha cha cha. You know, not what you're thinking about. Now let's try this bossa nova. No, we are, we always try to find something <laughs> new. We try to to hear a lot of music. And uh, I think always Eduardo is the uh, the channel that maintains Agora being Agora. But uh, in this uh, last album, he he tried different things too. He he puts his voice down. Uh, uh, try try to uh, do these mean boys more like like uh, never he did uh, before. So uh, I think we always try to to find something new. And I have to tell you that's that's the the thing that now I'm thinking and suffering because you know all the music now it's uh, immediately if you if you if you uh, uh, release an album I think at the week it's old. Okay, because mm -hmm. we're a lot of there's a lot of proposals and and great projects. So uh, now you 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 as a musician you have to uh, make music like, like like here in Mexico we say like tortillas. You know a lot of them like like uh, McDonald's like, hamburgers <laughs> and, and like wh white bread. Yeah, man, like <laughs> like 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 a machine, and, and I think that can. Uh, the music is gonna suffer something because, you know, the, uh, as I told you, I think I'm a romantic in something, some some things, and because you you have to you have to live something, you have to suffer something, so you can put that in your music, man. So if you wanna do only hits, 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 well, it, it's okay, but I think you're gonna start to sound equal because you are the guy that. You are not living in, in. You are not living something new. You are you are only repeating yourself. So uh, that's a good. I, I appreciate your comment, and I hope we can still fight for uh, uh, making that hour sounds different between an album and, and the next one. I guess for you, not it's uh, important to uh, lower your voice a bit as well with all the developments in seven and eight string guitars and the lower riffs coming with that <laughs> yeah sure it was it was a, a hard album this one because we've been we we got seven strings and six strings in the in the latest one the, the one that's and eight called, strings eight strings too. an eight string no but in in regreso al vertigo too mm -hmm. no no, no I, I i've i've been yeah i in in that record in Regresa al Vertigo we did seven strings and six strings and obviously the, the bass that it's a six string too but it was like uh, all, all the songs I feel them a little more, more higher so when when we came to to uh, to comp uh, to do this one to begin the compositions of the La, uh, melodic lines and everything it was hard for me to 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 hear the voice on that on such a low range it mm. was really 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 difficult because uh you can't uh hear the the tone because it's too too low so it was very difficult but we came i think the, we came very good we we did it obviously with the help of, like the Beatles said, with a little help from my friends. So, <laughs> <laughs> so we came we came great. I, I think the it's 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 that thing to do every time something different and have an, uh, 
uh, another way to to express and some things that you never did and maybe a, a, a jeopardy for you, but but that's that's what gave the music some some substance mm -hmm. too. How involved are you with each other's parts in the songs? I think sorry, a lot. Ah, okay. How involved are we yeah. in each other's parts? Yeah. I think yeah. very much a lot, a lot of. Uh, uh, if he wants to, he wants me to play something in the drums, he, 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 he knows that he, uh, he has the confidence to, 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 to talk to me and, and do that and vice versa. But always it's going to be different and difficult to win because, you know, we're musicians, we have our egos and, you know, I, what, you're gonna, what are you talking about, man? You're talking shit. <laughs> I've, seen, I've seen these guys uh, arguing in, for two bars. And, yeah. they, and like ours for two bars, they you no, know, the, we got the the arrangement got to be like this, and they, and and both both arrangers are, are are great and are good, but they are arguing just for two, maybe a, for one bar. I don't know, but yeah, man. I, I've seen man. things like that. We're like brothers, man. So <laughs> yes, you can talk to the other one, but it's gonna be a fight, <laughs> a good fight. Then then we we we, we can open a a beer and it's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then then I can understand why there's always f relatively long breaks between uh, between the albums. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man, that's yeah, the yeah. reason. That's a, <laughs> well, in Mexico too, we 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 are uh, uh, a country that doesn't have like a. Uh, uh, very strong metal bands, metal national band mm -hmm. uh, uh, fan base, and so to to promote really good an album, you can take an, just uh, just a year. You you got to take a lot of years mm -hmm. for playing in in every side that you have to to play. You got to take minimum three years to do it. Yeah, and, and it's. And, and sorry, it's sorry. not for because the distance. It's because the there are the fan. Maybe they don't get your song or your album yet. So you gotta go to to show them your music. Mm -hmm. And it's it's uh, a big country. It's, it's a big country, and it's a, a, a some some kind of of you gotta show them your music by playing. Yeah. Because cause you have to know, man, or I don't know if you know it, but Mexico is a great market for that metal music. We have a, a, a big, big, big uh, uh, festivals and we have, I, I believe every band has to come to Mexico, man. And it's going to be, if not sold out, it's going to be a lot of people. Mm -hmm. But it's different when it's a Mexican band. And I'm not... Uh, I'm not complaining because I can tell you, Agora is one of the uh, the bands that can uh, um, uh, can play in front a lot of a lot of people, but it's not gonna be the same. And mm -hmm. I don't know if if Epic, Epica came or Halloween came or something like that. It's gonna be a huge show, and um, if you are like a band, came. If La Crimosa came, La Crimosa any, any band can came and it's going to be a lot of people, a lot mm -hmm. of people. Uh, it's a good market. And uh, believe me, the fans are amazing. It, it, they scream and they jump and they know at his way the lyrics. She was sure red, but they are singing, man. Yeah. Something, they, they, are, they, are say, they are saying something, but we don't know what it is, but they are singing something <laughs> with, the, with the European and the American bands. But um, it's lots of American passion. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. They are, they are amazing. And mm -hmm. in fact, when when they adopt you, it's amazing. You can ask uh, Eduardo. Uh, we 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 felt that uh, sensation, and it's amazing. But awesome. it, yeah, is it, it's difficult for a national band here in mm -hmm. Mexico. It, you have to 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 do a double effort, mm -hmm. like, just like Eduardo said. Uh, yes. It's gonna be difficult. It's interesting that you brought up the uh, the audience and the concert infrastructure in Mexico, because I was uh, curious, you've obviously been there for over two decades. Uh, how has it changed uh, since the beginning? Has it professionalized, for instance? 
Well, I think all the bands start to do this more professional in a lot of ways. Uh, they uh, they use more budget for each uh, for each uh, production. Suddenly, the the world uh, gets smaller and more, smaller. Man, now a lot of bands wa uh, want to go to the to Europe or. Uh, USA and um, be part of the festival. So I think now there's a uh, a, a, a proposal for this uh, for this work. Okay, when we started, there's nothing, man. I, I believe me, there's nothing. No any a few, just a few concerts for of heavy metal, but in the in the uh, underground. Now uh, here in Mexico, obviously uh, they love another type of music obviously and and sometimes an awful music because talks about the the dark side of our society man you know uh, narcotraffic drugs and that that and and i can understand how the people can like that kind of stories man but that's the, the reality of our country but and misogyny yeah and misogyny but you know the metal can talk about satan and all that stuff but you know Come on, uh, there's a lot of, of, of issues and, and, and lyrics in them in heavy metal, no? So, uh, as I told you, I think we're an, a, a big uh, uh, big country. You can do a lot of money here and and you have the, the audience for uh, at almost any kind of music. So, uh, I think we're uh, a few enough now, right now in Mexico. There's a... a, a, a um, uh, how can you say movement? Not uh, um, there's a, movement. Yeah, there, there's there's a gang of a lot of guys that love uh, okay. heavy metal, and and now it, it's it's a little business, not mm -hmm. the biggest one, but it's a little business now in Mexico. And as I told you, all the bands now want to do uh, the the European festivals, the American festivals. I think that uh, I can recommend you some bands because I think the, the the level just grew up uh, at the beginning when we started playing. Nobody talks about the click track and something like that, you know. I, 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 we're very... Uh, I, I don't have the knowledge, man. And mm. when the internet... It came and and everybody knows what to do. I think that the bands are are, are starting to do a good job. Uh, I can tell you, I can't tell you that uh, this uh, Mexican movement it's one of the best of the world. But I can tell you that we have a few bands that can do good good stuff in 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 front of uh, the the international bands. No, mm -hmm. so there yeah, a lot of things change and now. Every everybody wants to have their endorse, as I told you. And now I want to try it with with Yamaha, Yamaha or Tama or Feral or Ibanez and that. And you have to tell them it's not gonna be. You are not making the favor to the brand, okay? The the you have to uh, you need to have a a relation between you and the brand, and you have to do something for the brand. It's not a, a it's, you you can. You, you you can say only now I'm playing Yamaha. Why you're playing Yamaha? Ha, ha. How do you play your drums? How do you can uh, spot spot that that brand? So, but I, as I told you, I think that old stuff can help us to to make this uh, scene more professional, mm -hmm. bigger, and and as I as I told you, it's a bigger bigger market. Uh, uh, sometimes you have the pop artist, isn't it? And when you, you you saw the drummers in my case playing with a, a huge pop artist, the guys who go to that concert or the girls that, that are going to the concert, not specifically they are gonna play drums, man. Okay, mm -hmm. they are, they 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 are going to dance, they are going to sing, but they don't care who's talk, who's playing the the drum. Okay, unless but they in fuck metal, up. Yeah, <laughs> unless they're fuck up. <laughs> That's it. You gotta go. But if you play metal, usually you can recognize the drummer, okay? And and it, you can tell me, but I believe that uh, 70, 60% uh, 
of the public that hears uh, metal can can play just a little bit of guitar or something. They they are more near to the to the instrument. So yeah. I think you can uh, you can brand your your I, I don't know Yamaha and, and all your instruments with a different audience because that audience wants to play. That audience wants to be in that. Uh, same stage man so I think there's a lot of things that it's happened okay and there's a other things that well have have their issues it, it could become better in the future who knows <laughs> yeah, let's hope how are you guys received in the less in the rest of Latin America I think okay man this I album think, okay. we didn't play we played that uh Colombia. Uh, Rock al Parque in Colombia. We played at uh, Honduras. Uh, Honduras. Yeah. And we they they were great great gigs. They were big big festivals with in Honduras. I don't know if you have heard of that festival. We they got eighty thousand people for for day, and we and they got just one day for metal. Even the the headliner was was Anthrax and uh, Black Label Society, I guess. Yeah. There were a, a lot of, 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 of uh, bands, metal bands that were Colombian too, and they invite us. So we, we're doing really, really good over there. We are doing, doing good at uh, Argentina. We got some people talking to us, Peru. Like, you know, Peru. Ecuador, Chile. Yeah, the thing is that it's different and more difficult than in Europe, man. Because you know, in Europe, they you are very near from each other. Yeah, man. small distances, I, I, absolutely. Yeah. But in here, if you want to go to Argentina, Argentina, it's gonna cost a lot of money, man. And there's and, a lot and of, eight hours, many yeah. yeah, so eight hours. It's it's different, but yeah. And I I, I have to tell you that there's a lot of people that match with us because we sing in Spanish and that's yeah. that's a reason isn't it there is no truth in this upcoming war we march together till the strong strong goes hey, hey, no as one in our mission we stand hey, hey, here we come because usually bands especially on the progressive side of the of the metal spectrum get softer over the years but imperio is your heaviest album so far yeah <laughs> yeah man yeah, sure. that 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 in fact that's that's the intention yeah <laughs> we want to try that and, yeah. and you know what sorry net come on no 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 we, we've been playing with a lot of bands and we have a lot of mm. gigs that show us a way to communicate with the people and we, we always think in dynamics so we have this ballad and we have this rock song and we have this uh more heavy metal and, more, and another more more uh, hard rock but we want to get there we want to be a, a, a heavier band maybe this is our heaviest hour ever <laughs> i think we are not getting like a last beat and Maybe Lalo has something. <laughs> we can try something, but as, as, as Eduardo is 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 saying, uh, I think that it's a a, a bottom, a top. Yeah. It's a it's a top to the mm -hmm. to the yeah. to the heaviest heavier music. But no, I, I think and, we we're and, comfortable and... with with this kind yeah. of, of of heaviness. It, it's mm -hmm. cool. It's cool. And as as Eduardo is is telling is saying. Uh, in 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 every big show or small show you have this you know this bag of weapons that are tough man so can contact very directly and then you can send a little ballad or something more weirdo and, and progressive but these kind of of songs are are your uh, uh, secret weapon man you know mm -hmm. contact and then come on let's do the, the next song and we've been playing with a lot of bands like an opening act and yeah. maybe this last time we've been with Motley Crue and Death Leopard and so we gotta have this 
this pet that wasn't so heavy, but show some of the new songs. And that's that's another another reason why we make the the, the songs and the, and all of our records that dynamic. Because we maybe you you go you go to a gig where you're not the the headliner, and so you gotta adapt a set list that doesn't be so so heavy. And another day you got you are playing with Carcas and you're playing with. Uh, Morbid Angel, so or Symphony the, X, or something Symphony X, and you got the tools to do it, right? Yes, and yeah. you got the the way to make the people come with you, uh, engage, and so that's why we make these things. But we were we all were like in this in this road to do the the heaviest album in Empire is, and obviously the. Manuel, the lead guitar, or one of the guitarists that is not here, is the heaviest, the, the one who hears uh, heaviest, the heaviest. Metal in the band. Yeah. So he's he's really glad for that. <laughs> so we want to him to be happy too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah.